finally got away! After all that work! So, you got sick of being a pampered pet and decided to explore the great outdoors. Sure, sure. I feel you, kitty. Take it from me, though. This world is nothing but one big litter box. Ivor? He's talking to what's-his-name the third. Quick, grab that cat for me! Huh? Ah! And there it goes. Hey. See that? Even the deadliest creatures run in fear of my mighty weapon! Don't be a fraidy cat. Thanks. <laughs> I bet you don't even know which end is up on that thing. Alright, take up your sledgehammer. You better nail this, because it's hammering time! Hey! I do know which end is which, but I'm warning you. Don't go swinging that thing around town. Some people have no consideration, I swear. So Ivor's working here in Olympias. What are you gonna do about the cat? I'll wrangle your furball. You got some business to take care of here anyway. That sounds right up your alley, Alvin. What is that supposed to mean? Ah, but if I use a little spud as bait, I'll catch that cat in no time. Don't even think about it, little buddy. Why do you always have to be such a jerk? Well, okay then, I'll leave you two to it. I don't mind helping, as long as you don't use Tipo as catnip. Now, off to Duval.
She said she's waiting at Duval Station. Exclusive expose. The terrible untold truth behind terrorist train tragedy. Investigative journalist Leia Rolando unravels the shocking mystery. Leia, what are you writing? Just jotting down some notes for an article. An article? You're like a reporter. Hey, there's no like about it. But those aren't articles, they're just dramatic headlines. You can't write a story to match a predetermined conclusion. Hey, professional journalists don't accept unsolicited advice from amateurs, mister. So as a professional, are you hitting your deadlines? You can't just copy off my homework the morning before class like you used to. Zip it, Jude. Why do you hate the free press so much? What does any of this have to do with the free press? I'm talking about professional responsibility here. What's with Jude and Leia? They're like... <laughs> Married? <laughs> Whatever could you be talking about? Seriously now, do we really look like that? <laughs> wow, Leia's strong. Oh, sorry. It wasn't on purpose. In Leia's case, the staff is mightier than the pen. <laughs> figured you were a no-show. Sorry I'm late. So, uh, this is your informant? Yep, Jude, meet Jolene. Call me whatever you want, cutie. Anyway, you know why we're here. The train hijacking, right? Maybe I know something, maybe I don't. I'm guessing it depends on whether we have money or info to trade, right? Hey. So that's the real story. It's true. I saw it all too. Wow. Good stuff. Guess it's my turn to share. Word on the street is Brot's been funneling a certain something something to Exodus. What? That's the name of the government around these parts, right, Jolene? Supposedly. Meaning? No dice. I like living. What are they sending? Weapons? Nope. Guess again. Spirit fossils and boosters. Say what now? That's right, kids. The next-gen stuff that's supposed to replace current Spyrex technology. Whoa, stop the press. This guy looks familiar. I suppose he does. This is Jude Mathis, the Spyrite researcher. Mom always wanted me to meet a doctor. You make me feel all chatty. Oh, Jude, you're like a celebrity. Rumor has it there's a demon prowling the alleyways of Duval. He looks just like a regular guy on the outside, but I hear he's hiding some monstrous power. He uses it to stalk his prey. <coughs> like glasses guy. Word is, even some of Brat's heavies have fallen victim. I just wrote it off as an urban legend, but maybe it's connected to the train hijacking after all. <sighs>
out of your mind. Put it out of your mind. Are you having trouble dealing with the train incident? That certainly was scary. No, it's not that. I can't forget those pictures on Luger's wall. They were so horrible. Oh, the wanted posters? I imagine Ivor stuck them up after he snuck in. Wanted posters? Were those supposed to be some twisted version of Luger and Glasses guy? I'm not sure if that was the intention. Did you see them, Luger? Yeah, that's the one. Get that out of here! I'm trying to forget! Odd that they're in the same style as the wanted posters in Riza Maxia. Why don't they just use photos? Luger, take a picture of yourself and bring it to the police. Maybe they'll replace it if you ask. What? Illustrations are supposed to be better at conveying the true essence of the subject. Or so I've heard. So that's the true essence of Luger and Glasses Guy? That's even scarier than their creepy spear forms. Really? Maybe when criminals are confronted with these wanted posters, a lot of them crack and turn themselves in. So how did you meet this informant person? Well, you know what they say. Swim with sharks, wake up with fleas. Wait, is that how it goes? Demon of the alleyways, stalking brat members. Uh, I'm not scared. <laughs> 